Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Science Query. I am your host Dr. Asha and in this video I am going to talk about land breeze and sea breeze. So before covering the topic, let us first highlight the key point which I am going to discuss in this video. First of all, I am going to discuss about wind, its definition, origin, types and importance. And the last but not the least, I am going to discuss about a short difference between land breeze and sea breeze. So let us first see the definition of wind. Wind is the movement of air from higher pressure area to a lower pressure area. Heat distribution is not uniform on the surface of the earth. The surface where the sun's rays falls directly gets a higher temperature. Due to high temperature, low pressure creates and this causes the natural flow of air from low pressure area to high pressure area. Now let us see the importance of wind. The wind maintains the balance of air pressure on the earth's surface. Wind also plays an important role in maintaining global temperature balance. There are mainly four types of wind. Planetary wind, periodical wind, local wind and last sudden or irregular wind. First let us see the planetary wind. Planetary wind is also known as permanent wind. It blows from high pressure area to low pressure area in same direction throughout the year. Next is the periodic wind. These winds unlike planetary wind changes the direction with the change in season. Next is the local wind. Local wind blows in a relatively smaller area between high pressure to low pressure. And the last type of wind is sudden or irregular wind. Sudden or irregular winds originate around south and north pole high areas. They are frail, cold and uneven in nature. Land and sea breezes are the types of periodical wind. Let us see how land breeze and sea breeze originate. During the daytime, the land heats up fast than the sea, which results in hot air formation on the land. This hot air rises up, creating a low pressure on the land. Whereas on contrary, the air above the sea is relatively cooler in temperature, as water takes more time to heat up and it doesn't heat up quickly like the land. As the cool air on the sea does not able to rise up due to high density, therefore it develops a high pressure on the sea. As we all know that air or wind flows from high pressure area to low pressure area, therefore during the daytime the air flows from the sea to land and this is also known as the sea breeze. But this situation becomes completely opposite during the night time. The land cools down quickly compared to the sea. Therefore, the air above the land also cools down and create a high pressure on the land, whereas the sea water takes longer time to cool down. Thus, the air above the sea is hot and rises up, creating a low pressure and thus the direction of the wind changes and it flows from land to sea in the night time and this type of breeze is known as the land breeze. Therefore, during the daytime, sea breeze flows from sea to land due to warmer land and cooler sea, whereas in the night time, land breeze flows from land to sea due to cooler land and warmer sea. Let us see some of the interesting facts about the land breeze. The land breeze flows from land to sea. The velocity of the land breeze is approximately 8 to 10 knots and it is limited to about 2 km perpendicular to the atmosphere. This type of wind has less water vapor as it is originated on the land. Now let us see some of the interesting facts about the sea breeze. The wind that blows locally from the sea towards the land is called the sea breeze. Sea breezes are usually seen in the morning and evening and are humid in nature. In spring and summer, the flow of sea breeze is more noticeable. The speed of sea breeze is around 10 to 20 knots. Let us see some of the major differences between the land breeze and sea breeze. Land breeze flows from the land to sea due to the difference in temperature at night. The sea stays warm at night, thus causing a low pressure compared to land. Whereas sea breeze flows from sea to land. During the day, the land heats up, 
faster than the sea thus forming a lower air pressure hence air flows from sea to land land breeze flows during the midnight whereas sea breeze flows during the morning time land breeze are dry in nature whereas sea breeze are humid in nature land breeze flows from land to sea the presence of low pressure in the sea and high pressure in the land is seen when the land breeze is flowing sea breeze flows from sea to land when the sea breeze flows there is a high pressure on the sea and a low pressure on the land land breeze usually flows more in winter and autumn this is shallow and weak a land breeze moves at a slower speed that is 8 to 10 knots sea breezes flows in the spring and summer these breezes are deep and strong sea breeze move faster than a land breeze that is 20 to 25 knots land breeze does not affect temperature it is also known as offshore wind sea breezes affects the temperature and this type of breeze is called onshore wind well that is all about land breeze and sea breeze if you like my video then please subscribe my channel science query and please like share and comment thank you